Miss Hayward! Thank you. That was bravely done. I was raised around horses. Perhaps you can use those same skills in taming my wayward niece and daughter. The skills required are not so different. Half the battle is winning their trust. Indeed. Where are they now, anyway? Honestly, Mr. Cobb, and I can look for Leonora myself. I don't wish to put you in any trouble. It's a little late for that. Besides, I grew up in this land. I know where the best hiding place is. You've no hope of finding her on your own. I suggest you go back to the house, Miss Hayward. There's no need to stay out here. It's only a little rain. It'd be a pity for you to be struck by lightning. Governesses, as we know, are not easy to come by. Mr. Corbin. Might I make an observation? You've already made the observation. You might as well share it. It strikes me as curious that a man might take such care of his horse while taking pains to avoid his children. Augusta's not my child. She's all too aware of that. She thinks you consider her presence here an intolerable burden. Those were her exact words. Well, she spoke them in French, but... Yes. There is no man alive I admire as much as my father. And yet the girls hardly know you. Perhaps in time you'll come to realise that's for the best. Leonora. You were discovered. I shall leave her in your hands. Try not to lose her again. 